Okay, so um, long time no see. Um, so this in this episode, I'm trying to um, discuss what is good potting soil. So this is good potting soil. Some people will use bark, which is the worst thing you can have. Good potting soil will have worms, a lot of them. So you dig into it. It's got a lot of worms inside. This is good potting soil. Okay, so don't do bark. Bark is the worst thing you can get because bark is the out, is the outer layer of a tree. The only good point, good thing about bark is that uh, it allows you to have some kind of uh, moisture absorption power. But you don't need that because you can have you can absorb moisture by using straws. Uh, some people would think that well, straw is too difficult to decompose. Well, but the good thing about straw is well, it's, it's difficult to, to decompose. But then, if you add a lot of urine to it, it will decompose. Okay, so uh, straw has a lot of carbohydrates in it, and then um, besides straw and urine, you can have wood, a little bit of wood chips, and tree leaves, and coffee ground, and mix everything together. And then dump everything into this pot, and you have a lot of worms. See, uh, the black stuff here is the coffee ground. So you don't need everything to be fully decomposed. You need only uh, a good mixture of everything. And I also have pine needles and so on and so forth. This is excellent potting soil. See a lot of worms inside. Uh, if you see a lot of commercial potting soil. Well, they rely on fertilizer. You don't see any worms because the fertilizer will kill everything. Okay, so I'm signing off. I'll see you next time. Bye.